ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome to Absolute Science. Let's get started with a little bit of magnetism. I'm going to take the steel ball and a copper pipe. Now this copper pipe is one inch in diameter. I'm going to drop the steel ball from the top of the pipe and let it fall to the red carpet below. Ready, set, go. One. <laughs> One. This time we're going to use the neodymium earth magnet. Remember to count when I say go. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fourteen. Wow. Here we go. Remember, the object is to catch it. You don't need to even have a big gap, just a little gap is fine. There we go, let's watch. And now move it, there we go. Catch it again. And one more time, this time let it fall all the way down to the bottom. And I'm going to catch it. And everyone's going to give her a big round of applause. The Mega Levitator. Everybody say, ooh. In the base, there is an electromagnet. This large black disc is also a magnet. They are made to end perfectly balanced, one above the other. Just like this, they levitate. That. And there it is. It's the Mega Levitator. In these bottles, I have a little bit of water. I'm going to drop some calcium carbide in. I'm then going to block the top of the bottle using a handkerchief. I will then light the escaping acetylene gas through a little hole in the back of the bottle using a spark generator. Now I don't know exactly how loud this will be. Every piece of calcium carbide reacts slightly differently from each and every other piece. So if you do have space in a hearing, you might want to block your ears. Here, weed. Go. Drop that in. Plug this up. Three, two, one. And there it is. Now I never do the explosions just once. The boys and girls love to see that again. So we are going to do that one more time. The grand finale. 